with DNA, DNA family. family. It's your boy, Abby. And it's your girl, Destiny. And if you're rocking with DNA family. All day, every day. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to smash that notification bell. Smash. You guys, happy new year. Happy new year. And guess what, you guys? So, wait, wait, wait. We've done one BG song on our channel, and we did not know what we was getting into. Mm -mm. We didn't know the rabbit hole. We didn't know their fan base. We didn't know anything, y'all. We did one song. one song. And let me tell you, that song did phenomenal, phenomenal. on our channel. Like, almost has, like, I think 17,000 views or something like that. Like, y'all yeah. really, 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 really liked it. It almost gave us 500 likes. Yeah. So, you guys really liked it. So, guess what, you guys? We have officially added in the Bee Gees to our channel. <laughs> and it's crazy because the very first Bee Gees song we actually did was with Celine Dion. It was featuring the Bee Gees. Mm. Then you guys had requested a Bee Gees song, and we did that. Yeah. And now, it's just like, now we're actually going to be reacting to the Bee Gees. So, y'all, before we even get into this, don't crucify us. We know some information. We know they're three some. brothers. We know that they're three brothers. We know that two are fraternal twins, and then there's another one. Um, I forgot all their names right now, but um, you guys have told us all the information. So I promise you, by next week, we will know their names. We will know so much more about them, but um, I am so excited to be reacting to the Bee Gees because I don't even know what to, ex to expect at all so what are we reacting to today we are reacting to Bee Gees from whom the bell tolls yep so we're reacting to this one and then we have another one dropping today at 4 p.m eastern standard time so stay tuned you guys so you ready i'm ready let's go let's get it mm. Mm. sketchy. The gorilla? <laughs> you didn't see it? I didn't see the gorilla. It might come back on. Mm. Um, but I was going to say a few things. Number one, before we even get into the lyrics of what was just being said, um, I loved how this video is like, it gives me an older feel. Like mm. a little bit of like, I don't know, it just gives me a little bit of an older feel. And I really like that. Um, but it's like, do you see the picture that they're referring to? And the girl is circled in red marker. Yeah, but she scratched somebody out. What, what was that about? I don't know. Um, but then also when you saw the Bee Gees performing on the rocks near that water. Mm -hmm. um, kind of freaked me out a little bit. Why? Um, I would love um, to be up there. Mm -mm. See, you're a daredevil. I'm not. Oh, I, like I would love that. You like jumping out of planes with, with balloons. <laughs> It's not blues, it's called skydiving. Oh, okay. <laughs> I'm really thinking like this is more of a sadder song yeah. and like someone passing away yeah. because it because he's saying it's for you it's goodbye mm -hmm. but it's for me it's I cry mm -hmm. so and then you're like seeing all these flashbacks of that's this why I woman. said there was a picture of a girl and she was circled got you yeah uh, yeah I, I think this is more sadder song yeah yeah I've seen you in a magazine a Little 
precious love was never mine. Now I know, but a little too late that I could not live without you. In the dark or the broad day, promise I'll be there. When a lonely heart breaks, the world man forsakes. having mixed feelings though like I'm feeling like it's either it's about a person that they lost like a loved one or it's about like a loved one like someone that they they loved that left them because like in one of the lyrics is it said um, I saw you in a magazine and it was something along the lines of I seen you in the magazine um, or wrapped around um, some other person that you're not supposed to be with two hours later okay so yeah this definitely was a very sad song mm -hmm. very sad song okay so first impressions first impressions um i definitely right off the bat um hearing the first couple of lyrics felt like yeah this is definitely a sad song mm -hmm. um i didn't know and then as it progressed at first i thought it was about them losing like a loved one because like with the flashback of you know this 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 woman that they're flashing back to i thought at first it was a tribute song to someone that may have passed away but then as the song continued on and on and on and i heard like that magazine lyric where it was like i saw you in the magazine mm -hmm. with um at a party where you shouldn't have been at around the arms of someone else mm -hmm. um that made me feel like oh this is like a lover or something like that someone who this person loved and um they got away you know the something went south with the relationship and they're no longer together so mm -hmm. then i feel like oh this song is about like regret longing for someone and etc so um but i was right about it being sad but yeah um i liked it um uh, i liked the visuals and stuff like that um you know it was pretty it was pretty good what did you think mm -hmm. about it i knew already from like the beginning like after hearing like 45 seconds into the song that after we paused the first time I realized that listening to the lyrics more and more that is definitely a sad song mm -hmm. especially once you saw like just keeps on you keep on seeing so many flashbacks of this woman um and you kept on seeing just um you know so much happening and then fire started TVs were catching on fire mm -hmm. paper was catching on fire the couch was catching on fire like everything was catching on fire yeah. you definitely knew by just the way that the video was being recorded that definitely it was about and someone that's interesting and something. because like that was a, that's a good point that you just mentioned like with with it, it being fire because mm -hmm. like those scenes to me those like represent memories and you know how like people have like pictures and mm -hmm. stuff like that of their relationships mm -hmm. and they'll throw them into like the fire mm -hmm. when they break up and stuff right. like that so those memories were yeah right. so those memories are burning so like right. you know he's not gonna get back with this individual right so 
that memory of her on the beach and all that different type of stuff that is being burned. That's good. Very That's good. Okay. That was I see, good that you I added see you, Miss Analytical, <laughs> seeing details and stuff. That's just, that's um, good. But overall, it definitely, you know, was a sad song. Um, yeah. And I just think that even just lyrically, like, all of them did amazing. Um, I I enjoy the Bee Gees. Like, this yeah. is the second song that we've fully reacted to by the Bee Gees, and I'm very impressed. Like, very impressed. I really liked it. Yeah. Yeah. But I definitely can see why you said, like, it feels like kind of like an older style video. Mm -hmm. stuff like but that. I like that. Yeah. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah, when, did, when did it come out? You said 19... I, I thought it said 1993 right there, but I don't know for certain. Um, but that could be just something else. I don't. I mean, it could be when true. the song was released, though. Was it 1993? I don't. I have no idea. But regardless, even if it wasn't, because you know this was uploaded to YouTube in 2017, but right. that doesn't mean when the song was made. Right. Um. But you know, it could have been 1993. And for those of you, you know, who are BG's fans, you can let us know. But just even overall, just even, it would make sense if it's from you know 1993, kind of, because if you even look back on the video, I mean, it definitely gives me an older feel. Mm -hmm. Um, especially then of course when you see new music videos today and stuff mm -hmm. like that but I really liked it yeah. I, I really liked it yeah, it's good. crazy that it has over 7 million views and I've never ever really heard of the Bee Gees yeah. until now <laughs> that's crazy living under a rock apparently <laughs> All right, you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. We yeah. have another BG's video dropping later today. And however, we'll have more coming soon. So stay tuned, you guys. Stay and like tuned. we said, we're in the process of learning. So we have a lot of reactions and we work consistently. So it's very hard to kind of, you know, remember everything about every group. But we're going to try to do as much research, learn as much as we can about the BG's just so that, you know, we can make sure that we come through with these strong mm -hmm. reactions for you guys. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and, and subscribe. subscribe to our channel because you don't want to miss our you next know. video. And like we always like to say, peace, love, and positivity, y'all. And we'll see you in the next video. We're out. Peace.